One of the best new features of Corel Painter 2017 is called Palette Drawer. I've opened Painter to the classic default layout, which is looks just like Painter 2016. What a, a palette drawer allows us to do is take a group of nested panels or palettes and change them into a drawer that is opens and closes similarly to a drawer. All you have to do is click the little gear and then click palette drawer. You can click it again and rename it. And for simplicity's sake, I will just name it nav. And now this palette drawer will open and close just like that. Now it works just like it did in Painter 2016. You can take panels out and put panels back in. You can even add your um, custom palettes. So if I want to add a custom palette, I can bring it in and simply add it to the layout or the drawer. Okay, let's take a look at a different layout. I'm going to go to layouts and I'm going to open up concept art. Many of the layouts that you have in Painter will already have palette drawers set up for you. And you can find out what they are by going to Window, Palette Drawers, and you will see the palette drawers listed. If they have a check mark beside them, then it means that they're open. So currently, we've got all of these panels are in palette drawers open. And it takes up a lot of space. So all I need to do is double click, double click, double click, and I've reduced these palette drawers to one little line. I can move them around and stack them. I can even change this one to a palette drawer, but I'm not going to rename it. Now what I've done uh, is changed my layout so that I have much more room to work. And I can still get to all of the panels that I want to get to. All I need to do is save this new layout and I'm all set and ready to paint in a much larger space.